If you're like me and you love playing FIFA or Football Manager and want to know a bit more about the team you're going to be playing with, or if you're just a curious mind wanting to learn more about Japanese football, then this is the video for you. In this video, I'll be telling you all you need to know about 18 of the biggest Japanese football clubs so you can make up your mind and decide who you want to support. So first of all, let's talk a bit about the Japanese Football League. The J1 League is Japan's highest football division. It's one of the most successful and prestigious competitions in Asian football and it was set up in 1993. It's a very competitive league where any team can beat anyone on their day. Japanese football also has two domestic cups, the Emperor's Cup and the League Cup. Now let's get into the teams. Kawasaki is located between Tokyo and Yokohama and is part of the Greater Tokyo area. The club was founded in 1955 and has become champions three times in 2017, 2018 and 2020. Fontale means direct to the front and the club's crest and colors have been based off those of Brazilian club Grêmio. Fontale's biggest rivalry is the one with Tokyo FC. This is also known as the Tamagawa Classico. One of the legends of the club is Kengo Nakamura who played for the club his whole career and went on to play for the Japanese national team 68 times. The city of Kawasaki is also home to one of the biggest industrial areas in Japan. The Urawa Red Diamonds are a team located in Saitama, which is also part of the Greater Tokyo area. The club was founded in 1950 and the name of the football club comes from Carbrand and owner Mitsubishi, whose logo consists of three red diamonds. The club has become champions once in 2006 and has become second five times. However, the club has won the Asian Champions League twice in their history. Yurawa Red Diamonds is one of the most supported clubs in Japan and possibly in the whole of Asia. They have some of the most passionate fans in the world, but they have also seen some controversy because of alleged racist outings. Now, their most famous former players include the likes of Shinji Ono and Makoto Hasebe. Kashima Antlers are located in the small coastal and port city of Kashima. The name Antlers comes from the city's name, which means Deer Island. And it also makes for what, in my opinion, is one of the most beautiful crests in football, which not only resembles a deer, but also a rose's form, which is the official flower of the prefecture they are located in. Kashima Antlers is by far Japan's most successful team, having been champions eight times, most recently in 2016. In total, the club has 19 domestic titles, which is more than any other team has. They also won the Asian Champions League in 2018. Together with Yokohama Marinos, they are the only two clubs who have never been relegated to the second division in Japan. And the club also has a strong Brazilian connection due to former legend and player, manager and current technical director, Zico. Cerezo Osaka is the club of the famous manga Captain Tsubasa. The club is based in the large city of Osaka, which is also known as the nation's kitchen and is also very known for its hipster neighborhoods. The club's name Cerezo means cherry tree, which is the official flower of Osaka. Cerezo's club colors are pink and their nickname is Sakura, which means cherry blossom in Japanese. Their biggest rivalry is with Gamba Osaka, with whom they play the Osaka Derby. The club has never won a championship but has managed to win the League Cup and the Emperor's Cup once, both in 2017. Gamba Osaka is a team from Suita, which is part of the Greater Osaka area. It's famous for its black and blue colors. Gamba means leg, which basically means to stand firm and do your best. Gamba Osaka is a very successful team, having become champions twice and winning the Asian Champions League once. One of their most impressive outings was in 2014, when they won the treble after just having been promoted from the second tier the year before. Besides their biggest rivals, Cerezo Osaka, they also have a rival with Urawa Red Diamonds in which is known as the National Derby of Japan. Yokohama F Marinos is a club from Yokohama, which is the second biggest city in Japan. Marinos is one of the only two clubs that have never been relegated. They have won the league four times, with their latest one being in 2019. They are one of the most successful clubs in Japan. The club was founded by car brand Nissan and is now partly owned by the City Football Club, which also owns Manchester City, Melbourne City and New York City, among others. The name Marinos means sailors and they are also known as the Tricolores, 
have in a similar kit towards that of Portsmouth. One of their most famous former players is Shunsuke Nakamura and the club is known for producing a lot of talent from their own academy. The city of Yokohama is one of the main ports in Japan and is home to many expats and also has the largest Chinatown in Japan. Shimizu Espos is a club from Shizuoka. It's known as the People's Club after having been formed in 1991 by local businesses and local people. The region of Shizuoka is historically a footballing region and they have produced a lot of players for the national team. The region is also known as the Japanese Riviera. Shimizu Espos also has one of the best youth academies in Japan. The letter S in their name represents four things. Shizuoka, Shimizu, which is the neighborhood in Shizuoka they're located in, soccer and supporters. And Paul stands for the spirit of the fans as they're known as being one of the most loyal and noisy supporters in Japan. In 2011, Shimizu Espos made a signing which was regarded as the signing of the century in Japan in Swedish and Arsenal legend Freddy Ljungberg. However, after just five and a half months, Ljungberg retired. The club has made the final of domestic cups 10 times but has only won it twice in their history. And they also have not won a league title yet. Their biggest rival is Jubilo Iwata. Jubilo Iwata currently plays in the second division but they are too big to leave out of this video. The club is situated in the city of Iwata which is in the Shizuoka region. Jubilo means joy and joy they had between 1997 and 2003. In this time they were one of the most successful Japanese football clubs and they won the league title three times. In this period they also broke a lot of Japanese records including the most goals scored, the fewest goals conceded and largest wins. Their most notable former player is Brazilian player Dunga. He played for the club for three seasons between 1995 and 1998 whilst he was still a Brazilian international. Nagoya Grampus is a club from the city of Nagoya and was founded by car brand Toyota. The club was famously managed by former Arsenal manager Arsene Wenger before he moved to the club in North London. The name Grampus comes from the two famous Grampus Dolphins which are on top of the castle in Nagoya and the club has won the league one time in 2010. One of the most notable players to have ever played for the club is Gary Lineker and the city of Nagoya is the fourth largest city in Japan and is a major economic zone in the country. Sanfrecce Hiroshima is a club based in Hiroshima which was bombed in 1945 by a nuclear bomb. Sanfrecce stands for Free Arrows and this is based on a story of Lord Motonari. He said that whilst a single arrow can be easily snapped, three arrows together cannot be broken. The club was formerly in hands of car brand Masta. The football club's color is purple and Sanfrecce has become champions three times. <music> FC Tokyo is despite its huge and easily recognizable name mostly been a mid-table site in Japanese football. The team however did come second in 2019 and has won four domestic cups. FC Tokyo is one of the oldest teams in Japan and was founded in 1935. It is known for its blue and red colors and one of their most notable former players is Takefuso Kubo who is also regarded as the Japanese Messi. The club is based in the neighborhood of Chofu which is located in the west of the capital. Fissel Kobe is a club located in the port city of Kobe. It's a city that is famous for its massive earthquake in 1995 and for being home to one of the largest mafia groups of the Yakuza. The name Fissel comes from the English words factory and vessel in order to honor its history as a port city. The club has never been that successful but they have become very famous in recent years because of their acquisitions of Andreas Iniesta, Lucas Podolski, Thomas Vermale and David Bia. In 2019, the club managed to win its very first trophy in the Domestic Emperor's Cup. Kashiwa Raisol is a club based in the residential area of Kashiwa, which is part of Tokyo. Raisol means King of the Sun and the club wears yellow and black colors. The club became champions in 2011 after just having been promoted back to the first division that season. They've mostly been a mid-table side, but they have had their fair share of relegations too. The football club also has won three domestic cups. Raisol has strong rivalries with a lot of the Tokyo clubs, including the likes of FC Tokyo and Yurawa Red Diamonds, but also with Kashima Antlers. 
Hokkaido Consadole Sapporo is located in the northern island of Hokkaido in the city of Sapporo. Sapporo is the fifth largest city in the country, but it's also a relatively young city as in 1857, the city's population consisted of seven people. Consadole basically means Ole, the people of Hokkaido. The club has spent most of their time in the second division, but since 2017, they have been present in the J1 league. They even managed to become fourth in 2018. The large city of Sapporo is also known for its beer, ramen and its annual snow festival. Sagan Tosu is a club located in the small city of Tosu. Sagan means sandstone in Japanese, which symbolizes many small elements getting together to form one formidable object. Since 2012, the club has played in the first division with their highest ever finish being fifth. They mostly, however, end up in the lower ends of the mid table. One of their most famous former players is Fernando Torres, who ended his career at the club. Shonan Belmare is a club from Hiratsuka, which is not that far from Tokyo and Yokohama. Shonan refers to the coastal area which they are located in, and that used to be a resort for the rich people from Tokyo. And Belmare means beautiful sea. The football club has spent most of their time in the second division, and they were most successful in the 90s when they won a domestic cup. Japanese legend Hidetoshi Nakata also used to play for the club before he moved to Perugia in Italy. Yokohama FC is a club from Yokohama. The football club was formed by the fans of the former football club Yokohama Flugos as part of their protest against their merge with Yokohama Marinos. It became the first ever supporters owned professional sports team in Japan. The club has spent most of their years in the second division, but at the moment they are mostly known for legendary player Kazuyoshi Miura, who at the age of 54 years is still playing for the team and is captaining this side. Regatta Sendai is a club from the city of Sendai, which coastal areas were hit by the devastating earthquake and tsunami in 2011. That year, the club achieved their highest ever finish up until that point by becoming fourth in the league, and a season later, they managed to get second. But since then, they've mostly been a lower mid table side and have been in relegation battles. The club supporters have been compared to those of German team St. Pauli, and they are some of the most passionate fans in the country. The city with over a million residents is known as a student city because of its many universities. Now that's been it for this video. I hope you learned something about these teams and you kind of have a feeling of which team you like best and who you would like to support. And if you did, I would love to know which team you will start supporting or if you already support the team let me know in the comments down below what japanese team you support now if you have a suggestion for any other league that you want me to do a video like this about please let me know in the comments down below as well and i hope you enjoyed please give it a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next week for another video bye bye